Hello everyone, welcome to another stream. We should be live now, and if we're not, then it's time to kill people. Yep, we should be absolutely live and gaming. Yep, that timing was pretty spot on, I think. How are we all doing in the chat? We're going to be playing some Assassin's Creed Brotherhood because I'm recording footage for a video to celebrate Brotherhood turning 10 years old very, very soon, which is next month. I want to get the video done and out of the way before Valhalla, of course, so I can commit my content to Valhalla at that time and just do that Brotherhood video early but and, and so it goes up right on time and there's no there's no stress or anything like that and uh, I reckon I reckon it will be absolutely easy to sort out once it's past it I am ha I have actually stumbled upon a curse playthrough by accident it's cursed it's absolutely gone cursed the game the game has gone fucked and everything is misbehaving one way or another. Like Technically, it's fine, but it's glitching out. First thing happened was um, every... Well, first thing actually was when I'm trying to walk forward, Ezio does this glitchy thing, and I can't seem to work around it. And then another thing that happened is... Um, for a, uh, Until I... Until I unlocked the areas with the other bloody towers in... All the towers I liberated, all the recruits that came from them were blokes. So it's like Sergei Haskot had uh, invaded the game. <laughs> uh, as for the rest of it, I'm just sort of... Yeah, no. Some glitches happened. A horse killed one of my targets for me. It's an absolute disaster. But it's fine. It'll make for a funny video. And I mean... We do like a bit of a curse playthrough. James Rostron, cheers for the super chat, which reminds me. Huge thank you to Jack Esquela, who donated before we even went live. Um, yeah, I did I did notice you, sir. I really do appreciate that generosity, gamer. That is what we like. Um, and, of course, the same goes to you, James Rostron, you absolute legend. Now, I probably best find myself a shop and buy some piss and shit. Um... Actually, I've been thinking right because I want to do as much as possible for the video. Like I don't, I don't want to. I will. I want to touch down on as many points as possible. Oh, sorry, but because it's a hefty video, isn't it? It's gonna be hefty. I've got. To, I, I realised that Brotherhood is actually a bigger game than I've ever given it credit. The story's only nine sequences long, so that's not exactly massive. But uh, and and it even and it feels even smaller when it goes linear at certain points. Yes. Um, but I realise there's so much in the world. <laughs> there's just so. It's probably one of the better handled Assassin's Creed games for side content by quite a fair bit. Because there's just a lot of it, and, you know, it's pretty good. Alright, let's go up this way and poo on the floor with my. with my dog. Okay. <sighs> Why does this game look good every time I see or play it? Because it is good, I guess. Oh, this is this one. This is the this is the clapped one, I think. It's the one with no, it's different. I don't know. We'll go up and we'll we'll do it. It'll be fine. It, oh yes, it's the guy who's burying his wife or something. Like illegally burying his wife somewhere random, and Ezio goes, "Yeah, you just keep burying your wife, brother." It's absolutely gaming. It's definitely better than Odyssey. That was never a. That was never that was never even a question though. Um, also, I'll be trying to rank up the assassins and shit um, as we go because oh fuck because otherwise oh, it's that way. It's fine. I thought I could save myself some time, but no, because you know we've got to do that as well. You're right, lad. Oh god, red handed. Leo de Russo works near the antique baths. Locate and kill her. Do you know the killer? I heard of a woman who takes contracts for Cesare, located near the antique baths. Leave before you are seen here. Let's go and kill this 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 evil multiplayer character. Yeah, I find it weird. <laughs> how 
how Assassin's Creed Brotherhood has you assassinate multiplayer characters. It's like, oh, okay. I can't complain. It's it's pretty fun to see these unique characters in the single player. Like, you know, it's a pretty clever reuse of assets, really. But even still, they must die. It's almost like Ezio doing the ultimate flex on all of the bloody multiplayer characters. How's everyone doing tonight? Well, Lee, I'm, I'm doing okay. I'm just gaming and recording and hoping that I can get a huge chunk of the game done in this stream so that, uh, you know, I can get working on the actual video itself that I want to do. Um, obviously, the reason being for the stream is if I don't double up, I'll, uh, I'll never get anywhere. Uh, right, you can be leveled up. You can be leveled up. You can be leveled up. And you can. And you can. There you go. I wonder sometimes what if there was a new version of AC Brotherhood with graphics like Valhalla. I don't know. Uh, you mean like the gameplay as well, but I kind of, I don't know, I kind of prefer Brotherhood's gameplay. It's just a bit simpler. And a... I'm not in a restricted area. Oh, hello. What? Could have at least let me... Yeah. See what I mean by a cursed playthrough? She ran into a bench and a man sat on her. <laughs> Made my life very easy. The other, there's another one of these where the, well, there was, I think it was an assassination where a horse killed the target. It would be great if I could see something. Ow, that hurt. There we go. My high graphics and depth. I get. I suppose. I suppose it would be interesting, wouldn't it? There's a bit of a charm to it being an older game now as well. I think. I think it's quite quite neat looking, even still. Obviously, it doesn't look like the most. Well, it doesn't look like the latest graphics by a mile, does it? But. I'm saying it does add to its charm a bit. Oh god, what on earth? Only recently started ACT for the first time. Well, I hope you enjoy. It's a good time. I also want to continue playing Mafia 2, um, which I'll probably do sometime very soon because I want to get I want to get I want to get some work done with that like, I want to get through that the definitive edition of course it needs to be done Whew. now where is my gaming friend it's a Borgia flag here and it will become mine so Bear with me while I make this Borgia flag mine. Now where do I find one of those pigeon places, one of those pigeon coops, where I can get the um, the recruits, oh there's one over there, I can get the recruits doing bits. Also a deposit has been made in the bank, I'm gonna be rich. Just a fellow idiot. Thanks for the super chat, gamer. I'd imagine thirty thousand florins probably works out as quite a quite a fair bit of dough, right? It's probably enough to buy yourself the finest of weaponry and the snazziest of cheeses. And oh my god, I could be here for months. Just trying to find a way up the fucking building. It's not that difficult. Come on. I have a friend. Anytime this week, man. 
He's got a crossbow to me and that, but yeah, you just... Yeah. Finally. When I was four, I saw my dad playing Brotherhood and I lived in Rome and my dad told me the game was in Rome, so I told him to go to our house. I was done. Cigarette chair, here we go, game of cheers for the super chat cigarette chair. I appreciate it. Now, let's send some of these dickheads on contracts. Otherwise, I guess I could send you on that, but I'm probably better off finding a harder one for... Well, one that just yields better experience. Okay, you, you, you. I don't know. Is th those odds are pretty good. Yeah, why not? If you die, you die. And there's one guy left. What level is he? Uh, she, actually. My apologies. Um, well, she can't do that. She's not that level yet. Can you do that? No, you can't. There's, no, there's not going to be anything that... Nah, is that... That's really meager. I'm probably better off waiting with this one recruit about... Now, to find a bank and to game at the bank. Has anyone ever gone to a bank and gone, oh, you know what, I could be gaming, but no, I'm at the bank. There's another one of these here which I could do, but I do need to find myself a bank first. You know what, we'll head in that general direction, it'll take us near a bank anyway. Well, it won't take us near a bank on the way there, but after we've done it, we can then worry about it, because it's just closest. Is it the Onetsio collection? No, this is the Ezio collection. This is the this is the cheeky remaster. I've got one last Leonardo's invention to do on this save as well, which is the fucking flying machine. As you can imagine, the playthrough is going pretty cursed at the moment. So, the well, sorry, it's called the bomber, isn't it? Yeah, this playthrough is pr going pretty cursed at the moment, so I'm rather reluctant to do it. But we do need to get the bloody parachute, I think. If I'm going to make a joke about it, it needs to be done. So we'll do it. Do you know my dog trying to eat my hand? Ah! That is that is a classic dog. <laughs> that Dogs rarely do anything but the classic dog. You know what I mean? Dog goes, oh, your hand is my dinner. I blend into this crowd. Now, where are these men killed? They questioned Brother Ristoro's habits, and now here they are, poised. You question him as well. Why don't you fear his wrath? A man with nothing fears nothing. I have remained true to my vows. I put my fate in the hands of the divine. They use Oscultas. Your vows did you from action. If you seek another to do what you will not. Please understand. Excommunication. Let's do this. Can. Where is he will be at the church, but can you just share Dennis with us all? At some point, for sure. Plenty of pictures of Dennis to come, I'm sure. Give, and it shall be given to you. For whatever measure you deal out Look at that moon. It is very big. It is the size of my dong. Right. Dennis Cam? Dennis isn't actually at home at the moment, so I can't really do a Dennis Cam without Dennis. Do you still play Assassin's Creed Revelations? Well, every now and then, yeah. But I'm currently recording a video for Brotherhood, hence why we're doing this. I did a playthrough of Revelations earlier this year, along with all the other Assassin's Creed games besides from Odyssey, because there are some things that even I'm not ready to ever do again. Um, whew, I need to go around this, I think. I need to swoosh around here. Probably better off coming at it from this angle. Um, now, I've got some crossbow bolts. They'll do me good. I have also got arrow storm, which is very useful. Oh, 
Ah, fuck. I forget there's there's a bloody Borgia Tower here as well. It's in the middle of a restricted fucking area. Five hundred thousand subscribers and you replay the whole game. No, never. I'd rather I'd rather just not do something that I'm gonna hate every second of. How are you feeling about Immortals Phoenix Rising? Uh looks seems like it's gonna be good. It looks like Odyssey again. But for the Switch. Maybe it's better in some aspects, but it still looks like Odyssey again. Jack Esquela, I missed your answer to my PC question earlier. I saw your PC question and I typed out a response. Um, basically, my, 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 all I can say is, it will be fine. Like, if you're looking to spend, like, what was it, five grand you said you're going to spend on a PC? Yeah, you, then it should last you quite a fair bit of time. Obviously, it'll still, it, there will come a day where it's outdated, but it won't, it won't be shit after five years for sure. Okay, I can fight here, that's fine. There you go, stab him in the hass. I like how I'm killing everyone and they, they still think seem to think that they they're in good with chances. Any fucker who thinks they stand a chance against a fully primed me. This is harder work than it has to be. Choose one and kill him. You know what Ezio just decides he's going to do everything but what he should be. This is now. Hmm. I've noticed there's no music playing for some reason. There should probably be music playing, but there isn't. There is none. There is no... My guy's in that area. He does need to die. But by the hand of... Oh my god! Really? Right, don't have to worry about him now. It's not my problem once he's dead. Stand in the corner and cry for a minute. Right. You're dead. Now I'm going to loot you. Oh god, no, I wanted to loot the body. There we go, synchronized that viewpoint. Um, as well as did that bloody thing all it all in one. I like to think it was a it was a well invested time. Just makes things a little easier, doesn't it? Instead of being in the middle of a restricted fucking area, I mean. Oh, there's a bank here. Where's the bank? I would like to withdraw some money. Zemir Zetsio's run animation really damn weird. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, 
It just looks like a man running in really heavy armor. Right, he's in this square. That much I that much I can tell. And then the assassin's just down there to to kill the man. Yeah, I don't even have to do anything when I have the boys in town. Like we got in Pace. Kill Brother Restoro by air assassination. No. I kill Brother Restoro by means of boobies, I guess. And look at that. Would you see this? That is where we must go. Bam. Bob had a bad day at work today. Oh, what a shame. Who's Bob again? Don't forget the flags are in the Romulus dens. Oh, I know. I don't really care about the flags, to be honest. But I know they're there. The sixth day. It's the Pope's old residence. Or something. I have low expectations for Valhalla. Uh, I reckon Valhalla is going to be pretty decent. Like, you know, it's going to have a lot to it. It's not going to be terrible by a mile. It may not be the authentic Assassin's Creed experience we've craved, but it, it'll have the aspects there. It'll have Assassin's Creed elements. There'll be plenty. There'll be there'll, there'll be Assassin's Creed, basically. But it just won't necessarily remind you of the good old days. I don't know. Now I can get back up here. Surely if you put weight on the top of that thing, it would just snap and then you'd fall to your death. But whatever. I guess Ezio knows better than I do about falling to your death. Do, 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 do. Oh, God. I am the captain of pain. All right, here we are. We're in the big room with the big boys. Welcome to the big boy room, where where everyone in this room is big and also a big boy. Sorry, right? That is such an awkward landing. That that thing here. Here we are. Hello, everybody. <sighs> right, gaming.
Might be wrong, but you should start privacy and listening to your live streams except playthroughs after Valhalla comes out because I think the streams reduce the reach of regular videos. I don't think they'd reduce the reach of the regular videos. All privating and unlisting the streams after I've done them will do is reduce the reach of the streams because for some reason there are, there are a few people who watch them after the fact. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Ancient kingdom from the old writing. Maybe I should start a specific dedicated streaming channel uh, where I re-upload streams to after I've done with them. But can I be asked doing that? That's, it just seems like just seems like such a compromise. The time compromise that you know sometimes you just can't afford. Look at that, it's a gamer bin. Oh, I absolutely despise this room. Oh god. It's such a fucking horror show. Is that over there that makes it a horror show back on the window when you get up there? Because you'll fall to your death and then you'll have to redo the entire fucking room. Different Twitch account, it's way more optimised to do streams. It is, but also Twitch will ban you at the drop of a hat for saying poo. So... Twitch doesn't pretend that... Well, the thing about Twitch is it's such a lonely platform. Unless you're massive, it's not going to promote your streams in any way whatsoever. Um, on top of that, when you're uh, when you're streaming on Twitch, everything can get you in shit. And also, they don't, they don't try to make any secret of the fact that they don't give a shit about you as a creator. They just don't. But maybe I will create a Twitch. But if I do, a, if I do create a Twitch, I'll not stop streaming on YouTube. Also, I'm monetized on YouTube. It would take me bloody years to get monetized on Twitch. Are you gonna leave? Are you gonna leave talking my shit? Make up your mind, Bob. Well, Bob, Bob is not a happy man. Good old Bob. If I left the comments in the stream, I'm sorry. My brother is mean. Uh, well, that's a classic, that. I'm probably more inclined to believe in God than your brother at this point. And this is coming from a... You know, I'm, I'm not, not religious at all, so... There you go. Oh, Christ. Uh, a lot of videos of Assassin's Creed on YouTube. That is... That is gaming. I have been meaning to set up a Twitch for the sake of giving it a go. But I have tried in the past and I wasn't too happy with the results. And I also didn't feel like the, like the site had much in place to get that channel, you know, off the floor. It's just to upload them on the second channel. I could do. I could upload them on the second channel. But even still, I can't monetize the second channel. It's just not monetized yet. I think I did the bloody creator program thing. It would be a pain. I'll stream them here just the same. Being how it is. I think the two channel thing will work great. I guess so. Unless it's a playthrough, I reckon for future streams like this one, I'll unlist them and maybe I'll pop them up on the second channel as like an archive thing. Or maybe I just maybe I'll, maybe I'll just leave it and just see what happens um, some of the time. Like I don't know, it doesn't seem like something that could. There's just there's just always the risk it won't work out. No, lock onto the thing. It's about the Uncharted movie, the recent picture, that's awesome. 
any one picture can look awesome. That's the thing. Um, I I don't know uh, if I'm excited for it. I I don't I th I think it's most accurate that I'm not really that into Uncharted um, as a movie. I think that well. It's hard to explain what I think, but I'm trying to. What I'm trying to say is, I just don't get why every video game needs to become a movie these days. I'm really confused. I forgot all together what I'm supposed to do now. It's one of those. It's one of those very much so piss easy ones where you just. It's just the thing that you never remember what you're supposed to be doing. Oh, there's the corner there that I didn't do right. Let's go. Yeah, everyone should subscribe to that second channel. It's a class time. It's where I'll do all the... It's where I'll do all the fucked memes and that. It's where I'll post loads of random bits, basically. If you want to see me posting shit, that's the place for it. Now it's going to swing and do the bits. See that? That was incredible. Straight. Finesse. Some pretty great shit posts there. That is my posting shit channel for sure. <sighs> Look at this bad boy swinging about. Ow. That hurt. This chest is mine, and everything in it is also mine. Delicious. Hang on, there's a chest here. It's mine. You are my chest now. And so are you. Do you think in Valhalla we'll be able to get Basim's robes? I I reckon so. I think it will be possible. I just get that impression, you know, that it'll happen. We'll be able to get Basim's robes. Open all the chests <coughs> and become the most the most minted gamer in all of Rome. That is what we're here for. A slap to the face was successful. Maestro, okay. I need to get someone to be promoted to assassin, basically. You know, I need to. I want to start attending them ceremonies and shit. Should convert the second to a re uploading streams, highlights channel. This main video, trust me, I know a YouTuber here from. For whom that works like a charm. Yeah, well, you see, the issue is... What works for one creator might not work for another. It's all about everything else. Um, I'll give it a go. I reckon it's a good idea. I'll give it a go. I'll bear it in mind. And I'll start, and I'll start doing that. The only exception will be playthroughs. If I stream playthroughs, those episodes will stay on the main channel. Anything else, like these random streams, will go up there instead. Um, once done. Because that way, the playthroughs can go up there as like a little archive thing. Well, uh, uh, the playthroughs can go up here as a little archive thing. And this can be this can be good for the bloody streams. The This can be good for just hosting the streams and then posting them up there. My thoughts on AC Valhalla. I look forward to playing Valhalla. I mean, I know it's probably not a popular popular take, but it's mine, just the same. Now I need to find myself an assassin bin and, uh, and shit in it. 
Playthroughs do age well. Um, that's why they'll stay. There's a there's a recruit there we can rescue. I have I have Ara Storm. I'll do it. Don't worry. Hey, I know this is random and horribly timed, that's no worries, but Fishy, I gotta say thank you for your content, it helped me stay distracted after a girl I really like rejected me hard, like really hard. Oh man, I'm sorry to hear it, it sucks when it happens, but I guess, I guess it's the, I guess it's the way of the world. I'm really, 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 um, glad that the content here has been a good distraction for you. Um. There we go. You are now an absolute legend in rank, as are you. As are you. And then there's a level one. Now, this is the thing that I love about level one. one if you get, like, a level one um, recruit piss early in the game, you can just, like... Yeah. You can just, like, throw them up with, like, loads of them. The chance of success is pretty good. But, I mean, for those... I don't need to do that with those. With this, I can get four... I can get four recruits pretty th pretty through it all, like this. Well, five of them, even. They all get 870 XP each. That means this one becomes an assassin. This one becomes an assassin. Yeah. As for this, as for this lot. Put them with these gamers, and then they all get fuck tons of experience. How many more we got? Yeah. Worthwhile risk. Now. Here we are. Let's go. This is the horror. I absolutely despise this one. But it's fine. We'll do it. We'll be okay. I remember being so afraid to get my initiates killed. I want sent to go on a 30%, uh, the 30% success rate. And he, he came back just fine. Thing it, I guess it is a worry when you send them out. <laughs> it's like, fuck, well, they're going now, aren't they? It's like, I, I can't unfuck this. Well, if I created a channel entirely dedicated to the archives of streams, no, no, Fishy 2 will do it, it'll be fine. This loot player needs to get the fuck out of my face. Mate, you're causing me to be detected by dickhead over there. He's a sweaty man and he doesn't like me. Also, for some reason, Ezio walk is glitched, and he just wants to walk slowly. I'm following the man to a secluded spot where I can shove one in his rectum. And by one, I mean one of my blades. That's as secluded a spot as you're going to find. This reminds me so much of like that first tailing mission from Assassin's Creed 1. Where you follow a man to a secluded spot and then beat him up. It's like that first beat up in one. Yes. Give me the plans. No! I will not! Stop! Stop! Where are the plans? Pass the guards. He 
in my house. It is the last one. And the machine. It's in the tower, on top of the fortress. Grazie. Yes, thank you, big man. Now he's going to run off and tell people that we're here, isn't he? Why don't you just kill him, Ezio? Uh, Ezio's poor judgment strikes back. <laughs> it's like a story, isn't it? Oh, do you remember the time Ezio spared the life of the of a corrupt pope? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Or what about the time Ezio did bits with his... Oh, God, no. I've, I have literally just landed right on the plans, so that's fair enough. We're not making bad time today. The flying machine in this in this uh, in this mission is fucking awful. It's just so rough to do. Right, let's go through with the gamers. I have to look at it this way, otherwise I'll slow down and lag behind them. Oh no 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 no! Stay with the stay with the gang. Stay with the gang. Everything's fine. Sometimes it'll just trail off the back and fall off the lot of them. It's so weird. Such a weird thing, and it happens all the time. Now, my best bet, really. I wish you could bring the assassin recruits out with you. But for some reason, you can't bring the assassin recruits out. Surely, surely maybe you could, you should be able to. Ah, oh, fuck, see? That didn't take long. Oh, there you go. Who's ever enjoyed this mission is a madman. There is somebody out there who loves it. I like the challenge, but when it starts to get tiresome, it really gets tiresome. Where's the nearest crowd of people that want to go into the bits? Follow, walk with them. Maybe just stay with the crowd of people while we walk into the bits. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Nope, that's definitely not the way in then. Fort shitty pants. Now if these guys walk on in this is that this is gold. But they won't. They'll walk on past. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Run away, run away, run away! Okay. Right, oh. That's not a way in though, is it? That's not going to help me get in, it's not... It's a bit too far. I guess going around the entire fort is a semi-decent shout. Gamer, I've done it. I've only gone and done it. Off you come. Run away, run away. Ah, oh, fuck. There's two of them. I thought there was only one. Don't put me back out where... Okay, I'm fine. Everything's fine. 
Why are there two of you? It's fine. Nothing happened here. Everything's fine when you're me. Come to me, sir. I would like to show you my... My knife of death. As I do in this game set in the Golden Age of Holland with Amsterdam as a parkour city. Would you be open to this as well? I have no clue. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, cut that one a bit close. Oh, fuck off. He's dead already. Uh, you know what? It shoots him, but it doesn't kill him for whatever reason. Because there is a fucking wall. <laughs> to be fair, I think that was a clear shot. Ah. Uh, oh, my God. <sighs> now you're taking the piss. Now the game is officially taking the piss. Not a terrible idea. You can't see me. I love how it tells me I need to get there. <sighs> oh, okay, well. Really? The stick the stick thing sticking out is there. Use it. There we go. not the way. Well, that was comedy. Here we are. They will tend to craft more 
weapons. Not if I game. Let's go. Ah, oh, bloody hell. Right, let's... Let's... Use my gaming skill to create many a disaster. Oh god, it's really difficult to control this thing. It's such an awkward little mechanism. <laughs> It works within within the confines of one of one bloody mission, doesn't it? Oh, that was cutting it close. Come on, turn, turn, turn. It's also quite restrictive. I'll have to come back for it now. This is really difficult to fucking get. Come on. Oh my fucking god, let me just hit the center of it. Done. Now we can get this one. Consider that bombed. I can fly and poo and shit. There we go, done. Now there's like two of these guys to deal with. I'm a clever man, I can do this. Why am I going up so high? <laughs> what the fuck? Sometimes it'll do that where it'll just launch you into the bloody stratosphere for no reason. And then there's more, because naturally. Is it ever is 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 an assassin's work ever done? No. Ha <laughs> ha! Felt that. Cesare must know of this. No, Cesare must not know. Whoa, okay. Just, just, just have me appear bloody flying into the... Yeah, cool. Done.
Well, the bomber is done and dealt with. Nobody will ever, nobody will ever use the bomber again. I'm pretty sure that's the last war machine. Yeah. Ezio, news has spread that all my inventions have been destroyed. The disarray allowed me to work on something just for you. What is this? A new device to drift slowly from any height. It is not as cumbersome as my flying machine. You can take it everywhere. Grazie, Leonardo. It does still look a little bit cumbersome to be in a pocket. And now I have the parachute. Which I can now use to jump off of shit and... Yeah. The recruit is ready to become an assassin. It's tasty, isn't it? That's what we like. That's news. Right, banker. Let's withdraw some dosh. Right, now, into the entrance to the place. Where is it? I forget sometimes. It's all the way around, isn't it? Here we go. To the bureau, to game. Leish e wakan motlak to kulun mumkin. The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark to serve the light. We are assassins. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. The gaming has been completed. How many assassins do I have? I've got two. For some reason, it only shows one ceremony. It kind of bothers me a little. I don't know why it just does. Now what? They they only rack up a certain percentage of success. There we go. And then now they're all off doing bits, and I can chill. Isak, cheers for the super chat. Classic bit of gaming. Yes, welcome to the good old stream. I like how this is the exit to the roof and it's just on the same floor as the rest of it. And then you just wind up on the roof. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Yo, Fishy, what's up? Uh, not much. What's up, sir? Let's get that money in our pocket, shall we? Withdraw the money. There we go. Bloody hell, that was loud. And now I've got this flashing at me again. Why is this flashing at me again? Oh, it's happening again. It's fucking happening again. <laughs> The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark. <laughs> Look at his face. Light. We are assassins. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Now throw yourself from this roof as proof of commitment to our cause. I've I've always wondered why are their robes identical to Ezio's? Like why do they have to be identical to Ezio's robes? Like the exact same robes, why?
I guess it's kind of cool. Now what we got? How many assassins do we have now at this rank? We have you. You're kind of cool. You ranked up quite a fair bit, didn't you? See? See what I mean? Send him on one slightly difficult mission along with somebody who you know is going to absolutely snaz it up. And suddenly this guy just goes... His, his level just goes through the bloody roof. It's mental. There we go. We're off on an adventure. And there's no boys anymore. They've all disappeared to do bits. And that's cool. In here you've got all the... Leonardo's inventions and shit that we... Well, the war machines we defeated. Um... And here you've got all the paintings we've gathered, which is pretty neat. Um, but obviously we all know that. So let's go. Bye fish have to go to class. Alright, take it easy, gamer. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to equip some outfits. I like the armour of Altair. Love how you ignore my queries, Fishy. Well, I can't read every message in chat. Give me, give me, give me a break there. Four days ago was my birthday. Well, happy birthday for four days for da four days ago. How did you do that goblin voice? What's your secret? Well, it's called being a goblin. Do you think Valhalla will be good after everything you've seen? Yeah, alright. I don't doubt it'll be a good time. There'll be plenty to like. There are a few things that I am a little concerned about. Yes, but I think on the whole it'll be fine. Raising an army was successful. There's another assassin ceremony, for fuck's sake. Stop sending me to assassin ceremonies, man. What the fuck is going on? Hello. One who believes in freedom. Ezio Aditore da Firenze. Ezio. They call me Nicolò Copernico. I have heard your name spoken at the Borsha Court. That's what happens when you choose to not to sell to Alexandria with Iron the boat mission in Origins. I'd imagine it just hits a loading screen and set, resets it before that conversation or something. Yesterday, I was a Templar. And today? The Templars wanted me to keep the findings of my experiment hidden. And that I cannot do. They Borgia hunt for you and your friends. My fellow scholars? The logic of such a purge escapes me. Find Copernico! But we will discuss reasoning later. Follow me. Help Copernico escape from guards. I believe the only way down is through this way, right? Niccolo Copernico, my favourite gamer. I back class was cancelled. Don't worry, you'll have it in about thirty seconds. There we go. These gamers show up to kill people, it's magical. I'm gonna go for real this time. I'm going to go. <laughs> Alright, take it easy, gamer.
give me a moment while I renovate a random, a random, well, I purchase, actually. And it gives me no benefit. Besides, I'm increasing my income by about a hundred florins. So that means to cover 22, well, sorry, to cover 22,000 florins, it's going to take me more hours than I'll invest in this fucking save to make that back. <laughs> I mean, I'll make it back pretty quickly in the game itself from other things, but it adds up. But to make that actually worthwhile in itself, it will cost quite a fit. It'll it'll take more hours than I'll invest into the save. You will be safe here. What of the other scholars? How do I know I can trust you? How do you know anything? Knowledge gathering is a dangerous enterprise. Easier to stay in place, learning nothing, than to risk in order to truly know. All right. Enlighten me. Take these letters to the scholars. They must be informed of the threat to their safety. Cool. But before we do that, before we do any of that, I must at least first loot that, and then we'll go and, I guess... But since there's no marker, I don't know. Assassin ceremony again. I'm going to continue my AC2 playthrough now. Goodbye, everyone. All right, take it easy, gamer. Also, don't forget to leave a like on the stream, show with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new, and be sure to follow me on all the all the social media businesses, especially Twitter. We recently hit 2,000 followers. Let's see how many more we can get. Two thousand, six thousand, it was six, six, six thousand followers on Twitter. Let's see if we can get some more in. Right, okay, that that that, that advertisement is out of the way. I apologise for my stumbles. Ah, oh, fuck. Right now, sell I. Do we have... What are the shop quests? Oh, they're in the bloody... They're in, they're in the bits, aren't they? The shop quests. I probably have some things that I can... Throw at shop quests and that now. But, oh. It's alright, the island is here. Yeah, we're also close to 250,000 subscribers. If we can get that number, that's a decent time. Assassin's Creed Ceremony be like, hello there. Cheers, Demonix Anxiety, Demonix Anxiety, however you say that, for your super chat. I really appreciate it. Oh, God, I need to get an Aconite. Where does one acquire Aconite? And also, why do I get the vibe that asking about Aconite will get me arrested? Now, what about you? Do you have any quests I can turn in? I need to get some more Vlad the Impaler coins. A couple of shrunken heads, some elephant ivory, and the rest of it. I have a big sword now. Right, assassin ceremony once more. The amount of assassin ceremonies we're attending these days. It's almost like we're forming an assassin brotherhood. I don't know. For sure, reach 300k when Valhalla comes out. When Valhalla launches, I reckon we're going to go hit the stratosphere for a little bit. When there's a game I can latch onto that releases, I tend to be able to get a good growth out of it. Our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark. We serve the light. We are assassins. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted.
So now I've got five of the boys. Seven of the boys make it. Eight of them. Nine. Nine of them are assassins, and the rest are going to be assassins soon. Right, I should probably just occupy this lot. Give them a reason to bring me income. They're doing that. The experience is completely arbitrary at this point. It's just, yeah. Let's just get these going. Oh yes, you do some bits. Generate me some dosh. I guess that'll that'll earn me some money, won't it? Um. Now I guess I need to. What do I think about Valhalla? Well, I played a little bit of Valhalla. I'm I'm quite like I quite liked what I played. I I I I look forward to playing the game in its entirety when it launches. Yep, I bought that. That was that was worth money, wasn't it? There we go. The Vatican treasure map is unlocked to me. Shop quests, pulling threads. I need to get some more silk and cardinals purple dye. Otherwise, I'll not be able to get the large quiver. Oh well, that's gaming. <laughs> so that's what that marker means, the box. It means there are shop quests to do there, which is pretty neat. And this entire island is like a hub island where the guards don't come. Once you're across the bridge, the guards start showing up in in hefty numbers. But until then, you're in you're in good. It's no worries. But they improved the PS4 Xbox trilogy in terms of graphics. There's a little bit of improvement for sure. With um, I guess it's some textures with Brotherhood, but most the most important change is probably the lighting. It's a little bit softer. It's a bit. Just looks a little nicer and more pleasing to look at. Um, die. I oh, said, so don't know why I wasn't because I thought I was. Well, welcome to the gamers. I guess. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you finally hit that button and now you're one of the gamers. It's good to have you with us. Um. Yeah, I'd like to. My end of year num like subscribers goal is just 250,000. If we hit that, we're in good. Like anything above that is bonus points. I'd like to hit 300,000 um pretty early in 2021 at the very latest. But I reckon we can smash it, you know. Don't worry, I've already got, for the video I'm doing on Brotherhood, I've already got footage of me going about pickpocketing everyone and then getting a massive mob trying to kill me. But I feel as if, I feel as if that's amplified by revelations. I'm going to have to wait a year before I can make the joke in its absolute glory. Lewis Price, cheers for the £5 super sticker with the ha 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 big man thing. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the uh, super chat. Your, your generosity is incredible and I honestly don't deserve it. I appreciate you, gamer. Keep on being an absolute sir. I saw them on my main account one year ago. That's pretty that's pretty neat. I'm glad I'm glad that you've been around for a while. That's good. Do 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 I've realised I've got more subscribers now than guards I've ever killed in every Assassin's Creed game combined, and that is a mental number. Okay, let's head down to the to the thief man because we need to actually do some main story. Otherwise, I'm, I need to keep progress somewhat balanced. I'll do the Da Vinci disappearance after I've done the main story uh, because that needs to do that needs to be done as well at some point.
I'm pretty sure my main account was banned though because I can't come on or chat. Why, why, why was that? Why was it banned? What, what did you do? Who did you upset? Did you upset somebody? That, like a moderator or something? Did they not like what something you said? I mean, maybe, maybe your account just got fucked or something. You know, are you excited for Valhalla for sure? You know, dare I say, Valhalla does look a little exciting in many aspects. Hello, I've got Pomandun. <laughs> Okay, that was... I like how he says, you just jumped on a thief. We can't have you around. You obtained the robber's money as well as your own. The robber didn't steal my money. I just obtained the robber's money. I robbed the robber. Defender Spy was successful. Oh no, it could be a glitch. Could be a gaming moment. I bought the SO collection three or so months ago. Finished AC in two in a few days. That's a legendary move. Right, I need to send some of these gamers on an absolute missions. There's just t there's just there's just three that need. The need to be brought up to. I need to find something piss difficult. Send. Oh, actually, you know what? Maybe not so piss difficult. And send these lot. Yeah, yeah, that'll do it. That'll do it for this one. That'll that'll get this one there. And then the rest I have to wait for. And that's fine. I love how Assassin's Creed Brotherhood's economy works. Like you renovate, you re at first it's pretty slow. You start, you start quite reasonable. You know, you're always, but if you always like invest into the city as much as possible, eventually it just gets to a point where you just stack tons. The first AC came out when I was born, so that makes you thirteen. Crikey. It's a long time ago. I remember when Assassin's Creed 1 came out. That was a good time. Yeah. Right. What's new? He appeared out of nowhere. I've sent my men now to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may. What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the Castello. Machiavelli. Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia knows the locations of our spies. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? I like this, is Machiavelli a traitor arc? Because, you know, you get to the... Because it's, it makes you doubt it. It makes you think, oh, maybe he is, maybe he's not. Oh yeah, that's what I'm gonna have the uh, hidden gun equipped. Etsy doesn't take the fucking initiative. Die, dickhead. Right, that's you dead and dealt with. There we go, that felt good. Connor is as bland as the food I ate this morning. Uh, I guess that's good to know. Curse the villa attack, then the castello, and now this. 
Let's get the likes up, gamers. Let's aim for 300 likes. I reckon we could smash that. Sometimes I wish they just went back to this engine. I mean, they couldn't ever go back to this engine, this this generation of the engine. They technically still use the Anvil engine, so nothing's changed. Um, but um, I don't think I don't think they'll ever go back. Well, they'll never go back. We know that. Um, I don't think they could go back because they need to bring it forward. They need to evolve the engine again to suit Assassin's Creed. <laughs> oh my God! Look at all the thieves. This man just dropped from the fucking sky. Oh God! <laughs> that man is throwing rocks. Well, these jumped off the wall thing, but this guy just appeared out of nowhere. Oh, La Volpe is the traitor. There we go. All combat is better, Lamau. Listen carefully. He decides what button to press. What? <laughs> the best Assassin's Creed combat I've ever seen isn't even in Assassin's Creed, it's in Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, <laughs> Where's the thief that falls from the sky randomly? Oh, he's there. Okay. I get the, the idea La Volpe is on a sabotage quest. Get off the fucking horse. You're, you're just making a mess of the combat. Bam! La Volpe, you fucking arsewit. He just showed up and went, hello. I have sword, I know best. Is that an Argonian from Oblivion or something? There's Mooch. Gamer, where are we going? Do 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 do. It is Gamer 1 and 2 on a, on a hefty horse ride through the bits. <sighs> Leonardo on his bench so he can tell me he has nothing more to make me. Uh, my favourite. Oh, 
I mean, it's kicking off over there. I presume that's the thief, right? Before I go and speak to the thief, I have a shop to renovate. <laughs> Assassins come in to do bits. This is an absolute clusterfuck again. When someone on horseback comes into a fight and they're on your side, or if you're fighting alongside anyone on your side, it becomes an absolute clusterfuck. <laughs> I just got bulldozed by my own assassin. <laughs> I love how only, like, well, the, I love how the, um, those thieves only knew bits of information each, like, what? Why didn't one know all of it? What? What's going on? He really wanted the kill. <laughs> he was dying for it. That's 12,000 florins in the bank vault. Here we are. Hello, Fishy. Your videos are very funny and make my day. Thank you. I'm really glad you- Fuck shit, wank! <laughs> okay, everything's okay. I really, I'm really glad you enjoy them. You know when you're supposed to go for the fucking- Was there a haystack up there or was this the, the plan all along? God damn it. Okay. Now, here we are. I didn't realize you could catch Tourette's. Yeah, well, you catch it mid flight while falling to what appears to be your death. A recruit is ready to become an assassin again. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck. Courtesans can occupy this gaff. Ah, yes, it's all red and lovely and good. Well, I don't know what use you'd have for courtesans out here, but they can live here just the same. It shows the best Assassin's Creed character so far. Yeah. You know what? I agree. There have been some close calls, like, I mean, Edward, Bayek, Altair, I guess, you know? I mean, Altair is an incredible character, but, you know, there are some characters that could just have been that more... You're right. There we go, and then they all got 700 experience each. And they can... Fucking cry. I'm just renovating places because in the end of the day, this is useful. Useful time killer. I think Black Flag was the best. Look at that man's feet. Look at his feet. He's doing a little dance in there. Do the blacksmiths usually have just this guy hammering away back there with his feet doing that? I 
Have you played Syndicate? Yes, I have. If there's a question to follow that, then please go ahead. Uh, can't say there's much chance you like the answer, but you can still ask the question. Where is Pietro? I cannot tell you. But Micheletto waits at the city gate east of the Terme di Traiano. He intends to disguise his men to make the killing look like an accident. He's doing the blacksmith dance. Machiavelli has betrayed us. We would both wish to deny it, but the truth is now clear. Do what needs to be done. If you don't, I will. Without Volpe's bees, I may require the help of my recruits. It's just a massive shame I've sent them all away, isn't it? Oh. Are there any AC games you haven't played? No. Not not any main ones anyway. Please, I have done nothing. Francesco Trovo. Dear friend. Would I lie to you? You told your brother about my war plans in Romagna, who contacted the ambassador of Venezia. It was an accident. I am still your servant and ally. Are you demanding that I discount your actions and rely on friendship? I am asking, not demanding. To unite Italia, I must have every institution under my control. And if the church does not fall in line, I will eliminate it entirely. You know that I really work for you, not the Pope. Ah, but do I, Pope? There's only one way if I can know that unconditionally. You intend to kill me? Your most loyal friend? Of course not. Are you letting me go? Thank you, Cesare. You will not regret. <laughs> Carl, give Micheletto the costumes for the play. Lucrezia is mine. No one else shall have her. Make doubly sure it is done correctly. I obey, Cesare. Oh, yes. Dumb Francesco's body in the tent. Well, he's a lovely man. I'm sure he loves having friends. That's Francesco Troche, or however you say his surname. Yeah. The Vanishing Act was successful. Assassination contracts unlocked. Is anyone ready to become a full-on assassin in that? Yeah. Do you think we'll get Assassin's Creed in Australia? You never know. Australia is quite a young country. I don't know how many historical time periods will really suit it, but... Well, suit Assassin's Creed within that, but I don't know. They're fine, it's... They, they know a, a thing or two about being dead.
Use the assassin recruit. No. What about me? I don't need to. I can't use a system that isn't available to me because I already used the assassin storm. The arrow storm thing. Yeah. So it's a bit of a shame, but it is gaming. Well, let's go. Colonization of Australia is, you should do the first, link the first one to Australia and, well, you could do, but they've got to have some form of, there's got to be some form of change going on in the culture of the time period for Assassin's Creed to really work. Put it this way. If Australia is still somewhat disconnected from everywhere else, how did the assassins get there to begin with? And then after the fact, you've got to get that a period that still sort of feels like it's far enough back. They can't go too far forward, otherwise it feels a bit weird. If this should work for Ubisoft, there are a few. There, are, I, I don't think I could. What are you doing? I don't. I think there. Are, I don't think I could ever. You know. I'll stand clear of this man. I could send an assassin recruit to kill him. Just 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 him there. But I don't think I could no. Oh I've got an arrow storm back. Okay, this time around. Well the arrow storm is very useful. Try to remain undetected for as long as possible. Sounds like a better idea. That man just saw, saw me fire a crossbow at his mate and said nothing. That really worked out, didn't it? There's an assassin recruit there who was being absolutely useless. Right, let's go. Imagine liking the armor of Brutus. Some people do, and that's their business, not mine. <laughs> Excuse me, gamer. There's a, there's a lack of urgency from these sorts of tales when um, <laughs> you can't gallop, you can only jog. There is no faster than the jog. Well, the. whatever this is. Whatever the horse equivalent of jogging is. Uh, oh, why has he got to go to another place?
Once you get dressed, you follow me to the place. Capito? Il tuo costume. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! I'm not even in the restricted area. It's fine, shush. I'm not in the restricted area, what do you mean? Stop trying to detect me for fuck all. Oh, he's walking now. He's on foot anyway. We're moving faster on foot than we do on horseback. Is that weird? Ah, must climb the Colosseum. It is night time suddenly. Them bits. And we shall see whether Elijah dare come here or not. My thirst is great. My thirst is great. Yes, thou shalt drink no more. Okay. I guess now I must head down and do bits. Targets killed. Where are the targets, I wonder? Oh fuck, I was going to use the bloody parachute but then I forgot which button it was and I accidentally pressed all of them and then the button to cancel the parachute after deploying it. Seems to be about me, doesn't it really? Oh, 
I reckon I'm making decent time. I'm disguised apparently because I'm wearing a skin I'm not disguised it's rather funny I am in disguise Done. Ha! You cannot save Pietro. The wine he drank was poison. As I promised Cesare, I made doubly sure of it. I am not yet dead. I did not come here to kill you. You is the cause of someone else becoming powerful. Agent of his own destruction. To be fair, he should have killed him, but whatever. Yeah, <laughs> a helmet just appeared. <laughs> Intervention. Fuck me, man. I'm carrying Jesus Christ. Stop bumping into me. Fucking hell. I don't think becoming anonymous is really going to happen here, is it? Listen, shop, yeah? He's been poisoned. The fault. Cantarella. Drink this. Hurry! Give him a moment. I feel slightly better. Leeches will lead to a full recovery. I cannot thank you enough. I... The key to the Castel Sant'Angelo. Now. What are you talking about? I'm simply a poor actor. Cesare knows about you and Lucrezia. Here. Stop! Wait for us! It's the man! I had to kill Ceresio. 
Not yet. Where does this passage lead? To the north, outside the walls. Let me through. I must go help the troops. Mm. He makes eye contact and then it's like, no. Oh. at the Villa Auditore during the attack. I hate this chase because it just goes on for so long. Bam. Done. Expertly done. For an expertly done man. It's a pretty hefty track, isn't it, though, for a minute? It's not too far. Do not swim. What do you expect me to do? Go all the way around? Not fucking likely. I have discovered a traitor. What? One of our men. He was at the villa attack. Here. He carried this letter. I like how Machiavelli was standing there, then flicked around. Once again in your debt, Ezio. What debt is there amongst friends who trust one another? Yes. Thank you for relaying the message in time. Come, Nicolo. It has been far too long since we've talked. I heard the Colosseum Passion Play took an unexpected turn this summer. Really? It seems Jesu Cristo was resurrected three days earlier. Yeah. Well, that was comedy in that. Roma. Very well, Ezio. The French and Papal forces are in disarray. Then it is almost time. Call the assassins together and bring Claudia. Now? Yes. Odyssey chicken flashbacks. Oh no. But you are exactly what the order needs. 
you have led the charge against the Templars and rebuilt the Brotherhood. Now we must put Ezio where he belongs, at the head of the assassins. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. You will now be known as Il Mentore, the guardian of our order and our secrets. Lovely bit of gaming. Why this sudden change of heart? I have always stood by you. I was the one who brought you to Roma, and the one who caused the explosion as you fled the castello. The mercenari who protected you at Il Colosseo were mine as well. You just did not know. Maestro Machiavelli, Cesare has returned to Roma alone. He runs for the Castel Sant'Angelo. Grazie. Well? The decision is yours, not mine. Niccolò, you better not stop telling me what you think. Why else would I seek the opinion of my most trusted advisor? Go kill them, Mentor. Finish what you start. Good advice. I intend to write a book about you one day. If you do, make it short. It's a good bit of gaming to occur. Why not? An assassin recruit is ready to become an assassin. Oh, yes. Leveling up the Brotherhood becomes piss work pretty quick. Well, it just does. Right, okay, I best get inside the abode and... The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark to serve the light. We are assassins. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Right, I need to know what rank we're up to with the boys. Haha, <laughs> all but one. We're nearly there with this boy, he's nearly there. I'm just about doing bits. A thousand experience is well on his way. And then we can do bits from there. Right, well, I'm going to take this opportunity to go, to go to the loo. So I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. And I'll see you in a moment.
all right i'm back and i'm back with a vengeance to oh god somebody spammed the chat with something uh something probably hello everyone we're back again i know i just went i just went to the bathroom to relieve myself and now here we are we're back in the bits and apparently i've got a revenue deposit of zero florins in the bank why why do this to me if I find there's no money in my bank, I'm gonna go and kill my dog. Oh, oh god, don't do that. That would be such a horrible idea. Such a fundamentally clapped idea. Just, just, just be nice to everybody. This is where the game sort of becomes stupidly linear. It's probably the point... It's probably what I should be doing, though. Like, you know... Why not? It's the worst that can happen. Actually, before we do anything, let's leave the animus. Just got an exclamation mark next to it, which means stuff happens. I'm more excited for AC Valhalla than Cyberpunk. Is it bad? No, it's not bad. You, you'll be excited for what you want to be excited for. Don't stand up too fast. How long do we have before the Templar satellite launch? It's October 8th, so that leaves us with 74 days. Not much time. Think about all that you've been through in the last month. 74 days is a long time. The pen on the test on the desk that's flashing. We're getting closer to the apple. I can feel it. If it were up to me, you'd take more breaks. Good thing the fate of the world doesn't rest on your shoulders. Hey, joke all you want, but your mental health is a serious concern. It only takes a couple of months for most Animus users to exhibit extreme side effects, and you've been in for prolonged stretches of time. I'll rest once we have the apple. I was afraid you'd say that. Let me pin some merchandise to the thing, because it's always good to pin some merchandise. Sean Hastings. Any good stories about Cesare? Are you kidding? He was notorious. Get this. In 1502, his top captains rebelled against him. He made concessions to all of them, and they rejoined his army. Then, on New Year's Eve in 1503, he got them together inside a room in Sinegalia. Everyone was arrested. Two were put back to back and strangled by Micheletto that very night. The rest were thrown into chains and, and killed a few weeks later. Wow. The amazing thing is that Cesare was so friendly during the months before, they never saw the trap coming. Machiavelli called him the master deceiver. Now that's gaming. That disrupted memory seems to be getting clearer. It's amazing. The sequence is repairing itself as if we're helping you work through psychological trauma. So I'm going to be a more balanced person by the end of this? I have no clue. But the idea is cool. Are you saying that because you feel guilty about frying his brain? Sean's on latrine duty. Deal. Oh, of course, yeah. He signed with her. Communists. <laughs> we like a bit of Sean chatting shit. We'll talk later. We'll talk later. Now get in there and find the apple. We're counting on you. So Cesare was pretty secretive. Yeah, yeah, he was, yeah, except, weirdly, when it came to sex. After his wedding, he sent a letter to the Pope explicitly describing the intercourse on his wedding night. According to the letter, Cesare and his French bride did the deed eight times. Isn't that a Catholic thing? What? You're supposed to send the Pope a letter about your wedding night. Let the old guy live a little, you know? <laughs> you know, that sounds quite plausible, actually. <laughs> I'm busy right now. That's rather, rather comedy. Can't interact with Altair again. Let's have a look to see what emails there are to read. Apples, banana, mango for Sean, lettuce, cucumber, celery, tomatoes, carrots, eggs, milk, butter, fresh pasta, fresh bread, chicken, ground, ground beef, bacon, chips. Thomas. 
Buns, diet, cola, orange juice, toilet paper, shampoo, double A, triple A, nine volt batteries, and red wine. Bloody hell. Well, what they got the wine for? Spear, sausages, potatoes. Okay, well, I need to find. This will be the interesting one, knowing that. Lucy was a bit of a naughty sir. Nope. No doubt on the remaining counterparts around the globe. Moscow is pooing itself. Everyone's dying. Everyone loves a bit of gaming. Well, that's all well and good, but I guess I, I'm going to go and game someplace. Gotta stay with the code. I need to go around, don't I? This way. Let's go. Out into the ends. I like how you got ten minutes to basically fuck about. In a in a little modern day park like in the modern day version of Montero Shioni. I don't think there's much you can actually do besides some run about. Um That's fine. Also, why is this sign in the ground? You can only go out at night as well, and the gates are closed. So there's no actual way out. You're trapped in at night time. There are secrets, aren't there? I don't know. Are there secrets? There are secrets. Oh. I'm sure if I find any, they'll jog my memory. They're like six collectibles. Oh, well. I thought, I thought, like, the statuettes from... I thought that was just two where you know you'd found them in two or something I'll have a look see if I can find any So I'm just chiller here in the church. I like how the cars are part of parkour. Oh, I see what you mean. Mario's sword has been collected. So there's five little secrets to find. Mario's sword. Um, I have seven minutes to see if I can find any more. Eagle vision. Do me some bits. Time doesn't exist if I am God. Past a collectible in the church, by the way. Oh, I'll have a look back now. I look at how narrow some of the roads are in Monteregioni and think, how the fuck did cars even get in here? And no wonder they're all tiny. And also, if you lived in a town like this, what use would you have with a car? Like, there, there, there is no use for a car here, is there, really? Oh, hello. Medici Cape. Why are these artifacts just chilling out in the open and why hasn't somebody taken them before me? 
Just run out of time, just become God. I can just leave again, and the time resets itself. It makes the timer actually inconvenient, as opposed to anything else. They'll be at points of interest. I'm going to leave, have fun, gamers. Right, take it easy, gamer. Let's have a look up here, shall we? Someone said there's a box of feathers up here. I never knew there were collectibles in Brotherhood's modern day. Maybe... Maybe they mean nothing. Maybe they mean something. Oh, hello. Maria's, f Maria's feather chest. Yes. Do we know where the other two are? Because we've got four minutes to get them. Before night time is ended. Brothel. Cool. And imagine it's no longer a brothel, right? Forget which building the brothel was. Is it this one? I don't know if it is, but we'll see. The opposite side, that's gaming. Oh, hello. That Ezio's belt. Right, one left. One left. Ezio's belt is near the walls. We just got Ezio's belt. There's one left. What is it? So far, we've got the feathers. We've got the uh, we've got the belt. We've got Mario's sword, and we've got the Medici cape. There's something else just inside the villa. We've got the church. Claudia's record book. Where's that? Why did Ezio leave his belt at the brothel, dirty swine? Well, that's the entrance. There's no way in there. You didn't get the one in the church. That's the Medici cape and we've got it. So okay if I just hide the kit, yeah go for it. If he's spamming slurs then he's not welcome here. As well as these parkour the game just doesn't let you jump for shit, you always fall. Yeah, it's because the game doesn't want you to. The moment you walk in there, you wind up back in the thing. See if we can get some Hang on. See what I mean? Maybe there's one down here, I don't know. What's the laptop in that in it? Let's go. Back out for another 10 minutes of inside the door to the right. Ah. Ah, oh, lovely and tasty. We've got it. Claudia's record book. And what do those things do for me? Now, do those collectibles have a point? I suppose we'll find out in a moment, won't we? 
Let's see if talking to any it triggers any dialogue or anything like that. Some some disgusting scrum there. We have work to do. Talk to me about the collectibles. My work requires attention, Desmond. We'll talk later. No, oh, yes. I just engaged in pointless collectibles for the sake of it. Back into the gaming universe. Hey, gamers. Oh, they're on the shelf now. Oh, that's cool. They serve no function. Other than to exist. Have I got any of the bloody quest business? I still need to get some aconite for my guy. I have fallen once more. I'm always falling over. Isn't engaging in pointless collectibles like 50% in AC of AC open worlds? You're not wrong. But it's the 50% of Assassin's Creed open worlds that people forget. Oh, speaking of pointless collectibles. I've lost count of the amount of times I've played through this game. Legitimately, I have. What's your favourite out of the Xbox trilogy? I don't know. It's probably it's between two and Brotherhood, and Revelations is just as good. I look at them all as a, as one experience, but I don't know. As far as individual games are concerned, it's quite blurry. <laughs> Ooh. It's so slow at climbing in the original games that you have to do side and back ejects just to climb at any reasonable speed. It's start-stop. It's not especially slow. It, it can feel it. Uh, but I guess the whole start-stop climbing system feels a little... Sluggish, but it's responsive as well. I think it's trying to be responsive too, and that is a benefit, I guess. This man is literally peacocking. He's going to go in the well. I've decided to throw him in the well. I'm trying to. I'm trying to throw this peacock man in the well. This. I would appreciate it if I could throw someone in the well. Right, you two are going in the well. You're going in the well. You two are going in the well. Join your friend in the well. I'm trying to throw people in the well. I just wind up throwing this man about. In the well with you, you dickhead.
I love when you throw the spear and accidentally kill. Well, well, without aiming, you wind up killing someone like this. Oh my god, the man bounced off. He just said, no, this, this spear is not going through my body today. What if I did it from this range? No. Apparently these guys are immune to a spear flying at them. I wish I had their power. Oh god. I'll do it. I'll do it eventually. No, there's no way I can miss. <laughs> right, maybe the game just doesn't want me to lob spears at crowds of innocent civilians. But I disagree. I think the, I think the game does want me to launch spears at countless civilians. I threw the spear so far. I feel like it's despawned. Oh wait, no, there it is. I will kill a civilian with my spear one day. One day. Ha <laughs> ha! I've done it. I've killed a random civilian with a spear. The spear's mine. Haha! <laughs> that felt good. Oh. I probably am going to wrap up um, fairly soon. Just, just, just so you're aware, everybody. Um, it is the end is nigh for us. Do I have any assassins who are? 10 minutes until there are these lot are available and it's the last guy to turn into an assassin and the boys and then they will then we'll be good well it won't turn it won't become an assassin from that from that mission alone but you know once you get them all there it becomes pretty pissed to get them all up quite high before the end of the stream, which game should I play next? The gaming one. I need to game tonight. I know what game I'm going to be playing tonight. I'm not sure what I should be saying just yet, but it's, I'm having an alright time. Skyrim is always a good time. Yeah, that's true. This is the quest that has me run into a random area that's bigger than my head. And says, find man. I'm like, what man? Oh, the man's here. Hello. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking useless.
Oh, that felt like I felt that. I felt that in my body. Santino claims ownership of us. He struggles to gain Borgia favor and must prove himself leader of the courtesans. Humiliate him in public, and he loses the support of the Borgia. We will not hear from him again. Okay. <sighs> Beat up Santino, but don't kill him. If we killed him, that's also problem solved. I'm destroying what's going on, gaming. Why are you beating up a random courtesan? Bam! Deliver Santino to the Pantheon Fountain. I guess that's a tactic, isn't it? Tasty, right. This place is mine. And look at that, and just like that, I have run out of dosh. What do you all think about The Witcher 3? I love The Witcher 3. I did a video on it and it didn't do too well for views. I did a video on the Hearts of Stone expansion recently. And I got like 4,000 views. And it's a video I really put my work, my back into. So if you want to go and watch that, then you can check it out on... You can find it. It's uh, in my Hefty Videos playlist. It's the latest edition. Um, now, let's get that bloody chest up there, get some money back. Witcher 3 is possibly top 10 games of all time. Yeah, it's, it's well up there for sure. It is that good, it's just great. I'll do that, I love that game so much. That's epic gamer, I appreciate that. Ah, uh, stabbed the man in his stomach. If you use the intoxication perks and modifiers, but... Hey ho. I could give some of these guys something to do, really, couldn't I? These two can go off and do that. If they die, they die. Castel Sant'Angelo. There's not going to be a way in here. This way. I want to go into the Vatican and explore. There's a Romulus tomb in there that I want to do. I'm not here. Shut up. I'm running past this shit and going into, into the Vatican. Let me in. I have friends. I like the Romulus tomb in the in the Vatican. The question is, will it let me do it? Yes, it will. Tasty. 
I think the Romulus tomb in the Vatican is perhaps the most aesthetically pleasant um, part of the entire game. Right, here we are, let's do it. Time we on. Did you see that white knight? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's real. Oh. A wolf in sheep's clothing. He's my favourite human. Well, now let me blend into crowds of big fuck off. Doesn't take long to get caught. It's this little bit here. I hate when you're trying to sprint through something and you just want running up a wall. Not what I meant to do. There's, there's no skip of the, the of, of this cut. And like I have my assassin recruits in this somehow. Did you leave? The Baron de Balois is dead. No. Now Bartolomeo D'Arriano is sure to rise up against the Pope. Cesare's campaign will be in trouble. Is that such a bad thing? Perhaps not. Some say the papal fund is lying in disarray. The same thing. The Pope treasure is never. His Holiness will see him kill another wealthy cardinal if you... How am I blending in with these people? Disgusting. It just doesn't make sense. He's looking straight at me and you can tell I'm not one of the boys. And yet here I am. Why does this guy just tour about in silence? Bloody ass, what's he doing? His name is Ezio Alidoro. Who? The assassin. He killed the banker. Some say he even walked the halls of Il Vaticano with no one able to stop him. There is hope after all. Perhaps Cesare's rule will finally end, and the church will be restored to its former glory. I will write the sermons. 
Then leave them for you within the shrine. Make sure you deliver them convincingly, with fashion. The followers will do anything we tell them, you Padron. They believe their God commands them. <laughs> Bene. Do you have the key? Yes, Padron. May the Lord be with you. <laughs> and also with you. Well, I guess it's time to go in and see the man. I have no clue how you can blend with that. Assassino, you will not get me. Yes, I will. My ascension takes me closer to God and away from you, Assassino. Bloody fucking hell. Well done, Ezio. You really fucked this one up, didn't you? Oh, come on, man. Move, Ezio. What the fuck are you doing? There we are. There's a chest here. It's mine. Warning me to reduce distance to the target. I have no clue what the fuck. Oh, there we go. Right, let's try this again. <sighs> Before the game gets tired of giving me a false warning. You know when a set piece gets broken down by this. Oh. Let's try again. This time straight over. There we go. Not difficult. So I mean by the rain outside makes it look incredible. I don't think this is the way. But this is the way. Look at that. I think this is the only time in Assassin's Creed Brotherhood where it actually rains. Or the entire Ezio trilogy, besides from maybe the lighthouse in Revelations. Does it ever rain in two? Ezio is not feeling the jumping today. He just can't be asked. He's had enough. God damn it, Ezio. He's just not feeling the jumps today. Wake up every day at 7.30. Oh god, it's Patrick Hill back once again. It's been years since you last sent that message. Or at least a year. Do you have that, like, saved somewhere? That is the only shit post I'll ever allow. you 
Ah oh, fuck! I've fallen. How did I get? How did I get down here? And more importantly, how do I get back? Ah, oh, I don't see how I get back up now. I actually don't see how I'm supposed to get back up here. There's a ladder. That. How did I get here? Ah, uh, allow the flag. It's not for me. To grab him, really. You saved me. Pray God. So that one is done. That pans out two different ways. If you throw him off there, you get that cutscene. If you don't, you just kill him. That's why I always throw him just off. There we go. That's a wolf in sheep's clothing complete. Just a couple of crockheads chilling in Vatican. Is there a bank here? Because there shouldn't be. That's not very godly. Nope. There is no bank here for it is not godly. But you know what is here? This. And I can't be far off now. With the recruits being back and all that. No secret cutscenes like that one throughout the game. I think there's a few. Look at that. Money has been thrown in the bank. Many, many florins. Just for me. He's close. Right, contracts. That's not right. I need something a bit difficult. Like that, really. That's 800 experience. That'll sort him out. And then... Is that right? Is he gone? Yes, he's going. Let's go. Also, the assassins... Your way... I'll only be away for 15 minutes. Ugh. Well, that's done and dusted, really.
I'm not here, you cannot see me. Even though this balcony is... This banner is not like, oh god. It's fine. It was the will of God. It was the fucking will of God, alright. Oh, there we go. The Catholic Church has so much dough that there should be a bank. Yeah, there, there, there should, but there isn't. Does that the message was successful? What edition of Valhalla are you getting, Fishy? Uh, I don't know yet. This is a really nicely dressed... You can play the loot in front of me. There we go, I killed both of the ones who were acting like prats. Let's get to 400 likes before we wrap up, that'd be awesome. We're really close, so we can smash that right up. There we go, 400 likes, that's awesome. The first musician who came up to me in Brotherhood, I shot point blank. Yeah, it's pretty hard to resist. I find it really weird how the wanted posters on the fucking brick tops. I've been watching you for ages since you had 70k subs. That must have been around when Red Dead Redemption 2 came out. Which is a long time, to be fair. So that, yeah, it's the best part of two years. Yeah, two years, 70k, was it? Was two years ago. Wow, it was only two years, but at the same time it feels like that was ages. We're nearly at 250,000 now. We're going through the numbers pretty quick, and I'm quite enjoying myself. But yeah, no, we're approaching 250,000 now, and that's mental. That's a quarter of a million people. Well, a quarter of a million subscribers, actually. That's pr There's probably some overlap between a, uh, with, with people having a couple of a, who own a couple of accounts. But, but still, that's still a mental number to reach. Imagine if the loot players played Wonderwall. Lewis Price, thanks for the super chat, but you've just hurt my brain. I worry that the loot players will now play Wonderwall. That man is off on one. Well, the thief's dead. Let's go get the thief. Do you think the Ezio Collection is great? Yeah, I mean, I think the Ezio Collection is a solid remaster trilogy. Nothing, nothing too big, but the Ezio Trilogy itself is incredible, and so... Yeah, it just, it just falls down to I like the Ezio Trilogy. The remaster itself is probably what I'd consider to be nothing too special. Uh, but, it's whatever. 
So now I get goosebumps when I see I meet Salter, is that just me? No, I felt it. God knows I felt that. Which gen console, which next gen console are you getting, pal? Well, first I'm going to settle with the PS5. And then I reckon I'll eventually get an Xbox. Jack Esquela, ever thought of doing a podcast with George? It is on the cards. I'm sorting that out as... I'm sorting something along those lines out. But in case it doesn't go through, don't hold me to it. But yeah, I have thought about it. Um... But yeah, cheers to the super chat, uh, Jack Esquela, man. Red Dead Redemption or Assassin's Creed? I guess Red Dead Redemption is the superior quality of overall franchise. Quite enjoy a bit of Red Dead Redemption. Oh, it's nine minutes of waiting for these guys to get up to speed with the rest of the boys. Ugh, oh, nine whole minutes. It would be amazing if you enjoyed the podcast. We'll sort it out. See what we can sort out anyway. If it works, it'll work. If it doesn't work, we're not going to try to force it if not. But I think we're going to work something out. Um, and it'll be a good time. Do you reckon AC will ever go back to its roots, unlike all the RPG elements in the newer games? Uh, you know what? I reckon one day it fucking will. Like Ubisoft will go, oh, we've we've hired this gamer, and this gamer, will, this one person will be like, right, okay, well, this is what this is what the fuck's going on with Assassin's Creed, right? We're gonna gonna we're gonna go back on the track and we're gonna modernize it. We're gonna make the game, you know, just the right amount of fan service, just the right amount of new. And just the right amount of old. And we're going to balance it out. Make it feel like Assassin's Creed. We're going to put stealth in. Social stealth. Uh, we're going to give you. Instead of like an entire country. We'll give you like a big city to explore. Plenty to do and see. Plenty to plenty to find. Plenty of stuff going on. Back in the old history ones. Part of me quite likes the openness of the RPG form. With the, the open worlds being more than just the cities. But another part of me goes, well, I kind of prefer to have high quality stuff as opposed to loads of just a big massive open world for the sake of it. But like the open so this guy would have to, so this guy or lady would have to be like, well, the open world can only, can only be as big as it needs to be. Um, the content well, the content there needs to be plenty of side content, it needs to be high quality, it needs to distinguish itself from the main content and needs to rely on gameplay that makes everything that we've put in useful. Putting some lovely set pieces back, uh, but keep it all modern. Create a parkour system that allows for proper agency once more, something that allows you to sort of be in control. Maybe make it faster, but other than that, leave it at. But, you know, obviously adding hefty amounts of stuff. Go start my work shift. Uh, have a good time. Have a good game. Right, take it easy, James. Let's head back to the island of Gamer. Because we can we can await our um, our assassin recruit becoming an assassin, the final recruit, and that'll be the perfect place to wrap up, won't it? So I've just got to wait nine minutes, but that's nine Assassin's Creed Brotherhood minutes, which is more like three hours. So. Bear with the game. Let's get some likes in. Let's aim for 450. Why not? If we're going to hang around for a little, little bit. 
then I'm sure we could get 450 likes. If you haven't hit a like, if you haven't hit like on the stream, please go ahead and do so. Share the channel with your friends as well, and hit subscribe if you're new. Also, before we uh, continue, be sure to check out uh, the social media, specifically the Twitter. We recently hit 6,000. Let's see how far we can go. Anywho, we're just going to wait for this final assassin to come through for us. And then it will be a wrap-up um, time, I think. We have 420 likes. We did have 420 likes, which means that we've absolutely done bits. <laughs> Never finished Odyssey. Too, DLC. Uh, too much dumb grind. Yeah, I feel that. Ireland is better than the UK. I've never been, but I hear it's nice. So I'm not even going to dispute you on that. Let's see how many more minutes my guy is not available for. It's got to be something like six. Four. Four minutes is all we have to wait. Let's see what people are saying in the chat then. Do you think Valhalla will be better than Odyssey? Uh, from the nine hours or so that I've played already? It already is. See, Odyssey's biggest issue, the biggest thing that I hated about Odyssey is everything was either a checklist objective in the open world where you find a location and you do a checklist, basically, or it's a quest which sends you to a location where you do the exact same thing, or a fetch quest where you just randomly go around running errands for people. Valhalla's open world... There's no checklists at locations anymore. There's stuff you can find there for sure. There's like little bits of lore you can discover as well. But most importantly, the thing that I really liked was the fact that the, op the, the open world content is no longer like side quests or anything like that. It's instead world events which don't have give you any markers, don't tell you what to do. It doesn't suggest what to do. It leaves it up to you to figure out what it is that you actually need to do. So there's no so there's no linearity of quests, there's no checklist objectives, there's nothing of that sort, and the end result is higher quality world design. So there's that. Why is it AC you have dedicated your channel to specifically, Fishy? I haven't. I've not dedicated my channel specifically to any one game. At the moment there's just lots of Assassin's Creed stuff going about. Um, another time a year it'll be loads of cyberpunk stuff. Uh, towards the end of November, I'm sure I'll make lots of content on that. I made loads of content on Red Dead Redemption 2. Probably have more Red Dead subscribers than Assassin's Creed subscribers right now. I'd say it's probably more like more Assassin's Creed subscribers just about. I did a few videos on Ghost of Tsushima, uh, or Tsushima, or whatever you call it. I wouldn't say those took off too well, but I gave them a good go. I've made loads of Mass Effect videos. I've been playing through the Mafia trilogy uh, with the Definitive Editions. Uh, I gave Star Wars Squadrons a go a couple weeks ago. I've done a few videos on Watch Dogs. Um, I talk about a lot of games. It's just at the moment there's a lot of Assassin's Creed stuff getting about, so it's sort of taking the priority, I guess. It's the only, it's the only thing. It's the only thing I can actually say is that it's just taking a bit of priority at the moment. <laughs> it is what it is, but it will be fine. Yeah, I came for this stuff and then got into AC and now have them all. Yeah, that's what we like. But I wouldn't say I'm dedicated specifically to any one game. I just find it weird that everyone thinks I'm dedicated specifically to Assassin's Creed. No, I have dedications to Assassin's Creed, to Red Dead, to games like two games like that, to Mass Effect, to other games. Um, it's just a part of my content style. But I'm never specifically a YouTuber that just does one game, you know. And no, I can never do that. I'm also going to whip up a fontage, which I won't be able to show you for a few days. Um, but that's probably my tonight's work. Since the house is going to be empty for a couple nights yet. And that won't be on... Assassin's Creed or anything like that. So yeah, what do we think of the Valhalla post-launch content before we conclude? Because that stuff 
looks all right. I mean, there seems to be a lack of Assassin's Creed elements mentioned in the trailer for it, but I think that's just the marketing team being clapped in the head and not understanding that uh, that they need to market Assassin's Creed, it, especially after Odyssey. Um, and, I were, and I hope that that's the case. I hope it's a conflict of interest between marketing and the actual game as opposed to being trouble. You know what I mean? Well, okay, and any minute, any second now, the the mission for the assassin should be done. Yeah, the marketing has been horrible. Well, it's marketed Valhalla as a Viking game just fine. I just wish it would mention more assassin aspects. I find it odd how the only mention of the assassins or Assassin's Creed elements in any fashion whatsoever is naming the game Assassin's Creed and referencing the name of the game. That's the only reference in that trailer for post-launch content. I reckon either both DLCs or one of them will have a Hidden Ones heavy uh, thing going on. But you never know. Will you play Watch Dogs Legion when it will come out in a week? Yeah, don't worry. Um, I'm already preparing myself for the launch of Watch Dogs Legion. It's going to be hard work, but I reckon it will be a good time. Assault of Diplomat was successful. Oh, yes. Now, the final boy to become an assassin, everybody. It's happening. We've done them all. Cyberpunk? Oh, absolutely. Cyberpunk is going to be something that I'm going to look into and make hefty amounts of content on if I can. If I can find mysteries akin to that of Red Dead, um, and apparently there should be some, uh, it'll be a good time. The wisdom of our creed is revealed through these words. We work in the dark, serve the light. We are assassins. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. And just like that, all the boys, all of the boys. Very nice video earlier, mate. Which video was it? Now look at them all. All of my boys are assassinos. From Gamer 1 here. To Gamer 2. This guy looks terrifying. That's a lot of lovely sirs, isn't it? Why are they all in Ezio's Brotherhood suit? Because they're all assassinos now. They're all, I guess, assassins, in it, And that's an assassin robe, I suppose. I mean, I have no clue. That I just maxed them all out. So now they're all sick boys and they could go off and earn me dosh while I game. And that's pretty cool, I guess. Yeah, no, there you go. This is the part where if you look in, you get, like, more contracts that show up, and... They said there was new ones, but there's not. And then you send them away to do contracts and that, and they go and do bits. And all that they come back with now is money. So we'll send a few off. Send them away to go and acquire me some funds, for which I will then use for my gambling addiction. See what I mean? Now, there you go, they're all off on bits. Anywho, I think that's where I'm going to go and conclude this stream, because we've been going for three hours. Uh, we've been we've done okay. Uh... And I've got to get to the point where I'm going to conclude. Well, I'm going to finish playing through Brotherhood at some point for sure. Probably on my own. 
uh, record it, of course, because I'm going to do a video for the 10 years later video. Well, I'm going to do a 10 years later sort of video for Brotherhood, like a video essay. Go Looking back at it, look at how it's aged. I think that'll be quite a fun angle to approach from. Look at how this game has aged. Has this some bits have aged okay? Other bits have not. It still feels like an example for Assassin's Creed in a few areas. Um, one of which being, I guess, the open world handling. Because there's quite a lot in Brotherhood to do, isn't there, really? But, of course, they can still take it further. I mean, I don't know yet. Anywho. Thank you all for watching this stream. I hope you enjoy. Be sure to go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, share the channel with your friends and all that wonderful stuff. That would be fantastic. Ah, oh, Bert, I apologise. Huge thank you to our super chatters, Jack Esquela, James Rostron, Just a Fellow, Idiot, Cigarette Chair, Isak Marnie, Demonix Anxiety or Demonix Anxiety, Lewis Price, and yeah, that's all. Thank you to you lovely gamers. And of course, a massive thanks to all the lovely patrons over on the Patreon who support this channel. Uh, on a monthly pledge and get loads of extra content bits and pieces including having their name up on these lists if you want to see your name up here go down to the link in the description check out the patreon but in the end of the day whether or not you think it's worth it is of course completely and entirely up to you so don't worry too much about that just the same if you want to check it out you know where it is and a massive thanks to everyone for joining me and I'll see you all very soon with another video or stream at some point. If you're just joining us now, don't forget to leave a like. And then don't worry, I'm sure I'll be back at some point very soon with some more content. But until next time, take care and goodbye. And that was a really smooth outro besides from the burp. Right, yeah. Well, take care and goodbye, everyone.